So what you're going to do is go over to Appearance, click on Themes, go over to Install Themes, and press on Upload. Choose your file. You want to make sure your file is somewhere where you can easily find it, either on the downloads or the desktop. Looks like I have mine in the desktop. I mean, in my downloads. There's our theme. We're going to open it. We're going to install it now. Takes a couple seconds, but it's going to upload. Theme is loading up. Then we're going to activate it. And here is our options panel. We're going to upload our logo. You can choose to use logo text, but for this tutorial, we're using a logo. We're going to select files. We're going to locate our logo on our desktop. There is our logo. We're going to open that, let it load and crunch. And we're going to use that image. And we're going to save our settings. Now we're going to go over to social options. Um, social options is a place where you can enable or disable the icons that you want to have. If you're not using them, just disable them. If you want to still have them enabled, that is all up to you. Um, after you do enable them or disable them, make sure you save it so that your settings will be saved. So we're going to save our changes to that. And now we're going to go over to our widgets area. We're going to go to our sidebar. Really, when you're doing your widgets, it's pretty much of a simple thing. All you're doing is, is dragging your widgets over. So what we're going to do now is we're going to grab a calendar and we're going to bring it over and we're going to call it another calendar we're going to save that and we're going to look at our theme to see how it looks still loading And there's our theme, there's our two calendars, there's our footer section, and we're going to show you how to add a new review item so you can get it in the slideshow. So basically, you want to give it a name. Um, but right now we're going to um, disable these comments. You can always enable them if you want them there, if you want people to comment. But we're going to set our image. And we're going to select our file. Just so that when we select the image, you know, people can see it on the slideshow. So what we're going to do is we're going to choose this photo right here. And we're going to open it. 
let it load in crunch and just click use as featured image not use as and or not enter into post just use it as a featured image and um, give it a title I'm just gonna call it another review and I'm gonna publish it and that is how you get a review on your uh, slideshow have your slideshow pictures here so uh, yeah thanks for uh, choosing this theme this is a good theme a theme for reviews uh, if you need any help just contact support and uh, thanks